James, I mean, just with one mention of his name, tons of accomplishments come to mind. But today, the kid from Akron is being honored by his hometown with his very own museum. How about this, which just opened up minutes ago, and we're giving you one of the first looks inside of this and giving us a preview of LeBron James is Kiera Cotton. What's up, Kiera? Hey, good morning, Austin. I have to tell you, this is one of the coolest things that I've seen in a very long time. As you mentioned, the doors to King James's Court opened just a few moments ago for the very first time. They're celebrating that grand opening today. The museum that pays homage to the kid from Akron is located inside of House 330. And ahead of today's grand opening, we got an exclusive first look. That's exactly what you're seeing right now. The museum takes guests on an immersive journey that includes never before seen items from LeBron's life here in Akron to the NBA to the Olympics and beyond. Notable artifacts inside include LeBron's all-white 2003 NBA draft suit, that's iconic, the infamous 3-to-1 Halloween drum set, and the original TV from his Spring Hill apartment and so much more. Now, throughout his career, LeBron has always emphasized community, so tickets to the museum are $23, but all of the proceeds go back to the community through House 330's job training model. Now, I had a chance to speak with Michelle Campbell, who's the executive director with the Family Foundation, and she said while the museum is all about LeBron, he makes it a point to recognize everyone who's helped him along the way. Much like LeBron on the court, he's such a big team player. He knows that he can't win a championship alone. He's a team guy. What you'll feel here, it's LeBron James's museum, but it's a tribute to everybody that helped him become who he is, his fans, his mom, his family, the community members, past coaches. And you can truly feel the team and family aspect here at King James's Court. Again, it's located inside of House 330. And again, it's celebrating its grand opening today. And they're expecting 600 people to come through here today. Today is sold out. But of course, we have more information on the museum's grand opening on our website. And Austin, I just have to tell you, I had the opportunity to actually walk through the museum. They did want us to shoot everything because, of course, they want to leave an element of surprise for guests. But I have to tell you, there's everything from the type of chips that he ate to his childhood trophies, even ESPYs. I mean, literally, they have the whole nine inside of this museum. So be sure to check out those tickets, guys. The chips. All right, Kira. And just 23 bucks. I mean, that's <laughs> honestly, what, what a bargain that is. Kira, thank you so much.